Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Dre and today I have something super special planned for you guys. I teamed up with one of my favorite brands, Dolls Kill, to bring you one of the sickest alternative hauls that I've done yet. Now, I love Dolls Kill. I've worked with them for several years now and they are constantly putting out the cutest inventory. Like it's always different. It's always super alternative. And by alternative, I mean daring, edgy, risky, all of those amazing things. Dolls Kill really kills it, you guys. And I just want to share with you the best things that I've got to date. Dolls Kill usually lets me choose for PR from a certain list of brands. Those brands are Current Mood, Poster Girl, Dahlia's, sugar thrills, horoscopes, and then they also let me choose from the trends or like the basic stuff that Dolls Kill has to offer. So full disclosure, that is what they let me choose from. I've honestly been wanting to do something really kind of fun and different. And so I was thinking you guys should actually choose my outfits for my next Dolls Kill haul. So use the links down below to see what you guys like and then leave me a comment down below on what you guys think that I should wear in my next haul. And when I feature it, if I feature it, I will feature your comment as well. So yay! Sounds super fun. You guys get to dress me. But for now, just sit back, relax, have some coffee because we're going to put on some edgy babe clothes. Starting with this amazing Dolls Kill robe. Check this out. I actually love the Dolls Kill logo. It's so badass looking. Just a basic satin robe. Can never go wrong. And it also has leg slits. So, so Dolls Kill just had to put a little cherry on top, you know, <laughs> as usual. And then underneath, we're all ready to go. I have my Dolls Kill tank top. Dolls Kill has a ton of merch that just has Dolls Kill on it, which honestly, I love their logo, so it looks really good to just wear it. They have beanies, they have face masks, a ton of face masks, also ones that don't say Dolls Kill. <laughs> Might help if it's not upside down, but this thing is really cool and it really completes any outfit, or it just doesn't ruin your outfit. This really cute purse, which I've been saving this whole time. It's been like untouched by human hands. I like how dainty, but like yet hardcore it is. <laughs> Does that even make sense? Oh! So cute. You can also wear it as a crossbody bag. But I love it so much. And it's also like a really nice genuine, or I don't think it's genuine leather, but it feels like genuine leather, which is actually pretty impressive. I love this thing. I love it. It's kind of like a little coin purse. But it's the perfect size. You can fit an iPhone in there and your big iPhone as well. That's all that matters to me. If I can't fit my phone in it, it's useless. So. This top is so metal. I love it. It comes with this little like cow ring dumbbell. What is that? Dumbbell? Right. Looking thing. Cow ring. Cow ring. It comes with this cow ring, which looks so sick. It kind of gets lost under all my jewelry, but screw it. It's all silver anyway. And it's a halter top, which usually I actually don't go for halter tops because I feel like it accentuates my bra shoulders. But this actually is really nice and I don't know, I've just kind of been playing with new styles lately and switching it up. But I have another dumbbell situation coming up, so let me go ahead and throw that on because I feel like Dolls Kill really killed it on this particular drop. It looks like I have nip piercings. Ah! This is dope. I love this shirt. It's a nipple piercing shirt. Except you don't have to show your nips. It comes out. 
I actually love Current Mood. I think out of all of the brands, Current Mood is kind of more on brand with just like me. Like, I, I don't know, it, it's like casual, but still a little, a little bit of festival, a little bit of alt girl mixed in there. And I don't know, they also have some like really like fun, sunny stuff as well, but they also have that like, this is kind of the quintessential doll's kill if you ask me. Anything that's like a corset, pleather, shiny, black. It just looks so good because it's like emo, you know? And I feel like before anything, Dolls Kill was kind of like an emo brand. Ugh. This is so dope. It's an underbust corset. I am wearing all current mood right now. And ta-da. Now, if that don't say make a statement, <laughs> I don't know what does because this is hella cool. Honestly, like I'm saying, Dolls Kill just has such different inventory. Like it's totally, it's totally unique to Dolls Kill. You can't really find these types of clothes anywhere else unless you go to like specific niche goth websites. But still, in my opinion, Dolls Kill kills it because they always have the right amount of feminine and edgy mixed together. This is so metal. I love it. I just feel like a badass babe right now. A little bit of Lara Croft mixed in with like the girl either from Resident Evil or my babe from Underworld. Oh, she was so hot in that movie. Kate Beckinsale. This top is extremely versatile. You could do so much with it. The corset top or the top underneath, it really doesn't matter, but these are killer. All right. Next, if you guys haven't already seen my shoe collection haul, then definitely watch that because I feature these and I actually wear all of these shoes that you see here. And it's a really great video, so I don't know, check it out. I love this funky little number from Current Mood. As I said, they have a ton of funky cute stuff and kind of like some weird numbers as well, but you can totally play them up or you can play them down. You can do whatever you want with this dress. And of course, it's my favorite color, green. And it looks so cute with my shoes. Ah, I actually got these from Amazon, but you could probably get better ones from Dolls Kill low key. But if you want the shoes, you could check out the affiliate link down below. Ooh, you're welcome. And also, it's just a nice and soft material. It's cotton. So if it's too big, you know, it's gonna shrink nicely in the washer and dryer. <laughs> I just feel so chic when I'm wearing this. This is the most adorable little dress ever. Kind of makes me feel like a little anime girl when I'm wearing it. By the time we finish this video, my hair is gonna be ruined. It almost reminds me of Rugrats. Loving this. What do you guys think? Let's move on. This one is happening. I love it. It's so modern. I love the graffiti design. So different and mod. I also really like it. It's kind of like got a little grunge vibe to it. I honestly got this in a size small and there is a little bit of room. So if I could go back in time, I would have got an extra small. That's the only thing about this dress, but now that I put it on, I feel like I was just overreacting. Like, it looks great. Also from Current Mood. Oh, God. <laughs> and then this unties, so you can literally do whatever you want. If you want to bring this around the front, or if you want to get crazy and have like a bunch of straps, then you can make this as strappy as you want, girl. basically just a square neck halter dress. I think I would wear it with these shoes. I love these chunky platforms and these are also Current Mood as well. Current Mood sells shoes and as you can see they are killer. Every time I wear these I always get compliments on them so Current Mood you guys you know what's up. I see you. All right I think that's it for Current Mood so now let's move on to poster girl. All right, I think this is my only poster girl piece that I have to show you guys, but poster girl is so
so sick you guys i love this piece so much i love the acid olive wash this is very progressive in my opinion like because it's got the cargo design with the straps on it it kind of makes it look a little bit more modern but i love this you could wear this every day and i would too because oh, look at it and then this little matching top is perfect it's wonderful darling no poster girl is probably one of the more sophisticated brands that they have dolls kill has a ton of festival fashion but they also have loungewear and everyday wear stuff that you could wear to the grocery store and everyone's going to be complimenting your outfit but you're still going to be looking casual and cute i love this and it actually comes with pockets i love to put my hands in my pockets it makes me feel like safe <laughs> Probably one of my new favorite everyday outfits that I have right now. So yeah. And I would totally pair this with my festival boots. These are so sick. And, oh, and these are actually poster girl as well. Wow. What are the odds? But yeah, these are so cool. And then they also have a zipper, which I really appreciate because getting in and out of boots like this is such a pain. But these are dope. I don't think they sell these anymore, so if you want them, you're just gonna have to look. They're so amazing. <laughs> now I am wearing Delia's, and the pants are actually current mood. They were a part of the nipple shirt drop, and I love these pants. These are so dope. And then Delia's, I think I'm saying that right, Delia's, they are a super retro, funky vibe like they just have the most cool retro designs that i've ever seen like and they're constantly coming out with new stuff that just reminds me of like the 80s and 90s a little bit of the early 2k and a little bit of that beach vibe as well but i mean this top is just so dope i love it this is in honestly any type of like top like this, just basic tops. These kind of remind me of Unif. So anything that reminds me of Unif, I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I feel like Delia's really kills it. They don't sell these anymore. These are the beach access platforms and they're also Delia's. They're just so beautiful. I just needed you to get a look at them because they're probably one of my favorite shoes that I own. And that's why I never wear them, but they're so cute. I literally love these. These are <sighs> wonderful when i was in middle school i used to love to sag my pants like i would actually wear shorts underneath and then i would wear i would sag my pants because that was that was the steez you know like i like sagging my pants still to this day i like the way it looks I'll carry my shank around yeah that's right <laughs> oh yeah it also comes with these these little like fake suspender looking things which are super it's dope Honestly, this is my favorite outfit so far. I don't think I want to take it off, but I gotta. So let's go ahead and keep going. <laughs> All right, this next one is horoscopes. And I actually love this dress. It is perfectly form fitting, but then it also has like a little bit of a give at the bottom. And then it has a lining underneath but the mesh top is like super flowy. Like, do you see this? So it just kind of like, I don't know. I really like it. The whole design of this dress is great. Like I really, really like it. And I'm pretty sure that this was Aries, but Horoscopes has some really awesome drops and they're constantly coming out with new drops every single month because every month there is a new Horoscope. So that's what's really cool about Horoscopes. Last year, Horoscopes really disappointed me when it was my turn, cancer season. So horoscopes, please oh, come through this year, please. Last year was disappointing. I know it was 2020 and like, it was like height of Rona. So I forgive you, I forgive you, but you better make a comeback this year because cancer needs to kill it. So Aries got a really good drop, in other words, and I was mad about it. Everyone else gets a good drop except cancer. <laughs> oh well. I guess I'll cry about it like cancers do. <sighs> Monster High vibes. That's literally why I got this, because I was like, Monster High. Love it. 
I love that cartoon. That cartoon is iconic for its fashion, let's be real. It's almost like Bratz dolls. And it would go perfectly with these sugar thrills boots, oh my gosh, or even some black thigh-high socks and some garters. Now we're on to something. That would be the perfect monster high look and it would totally pull it all together. Love these boots. I have one piece from the iconic Dolls Kill Bratz collection. This drop was so perfect. It, they really were spot on with the early Y2K vibes. And I was so excited when they dropped it. It's been a while, but I'm pretty sure they already sold out like three times on this collection. And I'm just so happy that I actually have a piece. I've just been saving it this entire time because it's so cute. Like I don't even want to wear it and get it dirty. Like, oh. And it also came with this adorable Bratz necklace. This is a size medium. I probably would go back in time and get a size extra large just so that this would like really be a dress. But with some thigh high boots, you'll be ready to take over the town. And with some thigh high boots, girl, you're gonna have a passion for fashion. <laughs> See what I did there? And then last but not least, Sugar Thrills. I saved the best for last Sugar Thrills. They are so sweet and innocent with a little hint of feminine. I am absolutely adoring this set. This is probably the only sexy lingerie that I got for this haul. And I paired it with this jacket from Current Mood. I'm telling you guys, Current Mood has so many stuff that you guys need to check out. I still don't think they also, I don't think that they're selling this jacket anymore. That was more winter, but it went perfectly with my Sugar Thrills lingerie set. This totally kind of reminds me of like a summer picnic. It's very sweet. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching my video. Make sure you hit that like button. It helps my videos out so much. You have no idea. And if you hit that subscribe button, you will have good luck for the next three days. Look at me bribing y'all. <laughs> well, thank you for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed my video and have a good one. Thank you to Dolls Gill for sending me all these clothes.